Are you interested in starting a vending machine business or do you already have one up and going? You just need a few tips to help get you to the next level. Well, here I'll provide with you eight pro tips for a vending machine business. Tip number one, location. So your location is gonna determine your level of success. And a few examples of the best locations would be in a school, a university, a motel or hotel, or some sort of gymnasium. Tip number two, you wanna make sure you have the right machine in the right place. Just because the machine is not producing well in a certain location does not mean it wouldn't do good in another one. Drink machines would do better in an active workplace or an attraction site that will require physical effort or maybe a lot of walking. On the other hand, snack machines may do better in places where food is not provided or workplaces that may be far away from restaurants. Diversify your collection. You should want to be open to trying different machines such as snack machines, drink machines, toy machines, and etc. Adding more machines will increase your chance to get sales. Tip number four, try healthy, organic, or vegan food. This could work greatly in the correct environments. Offering a healthy alternative can at times give you an upper hand in the market. Tip number five, keep your machine clean and very well stocked. The worst things anyone could see is either a dirty machine or an empty one. And presentable machines will often give you a better return. Tip number six is going to be credit card readers. So you want to make sure you add credit card readers to all of your machines to increase your sales. Currency is becoming more digital, meaning people are carrying more cards and they're carrying less cash. Tip number seven, you want to check all machine functions. And this is what you want to do before purchasing any new machines are used. So you want to make sure that every button, every function works on your machine. One misfunction could be the determination of a sale or a lost customer. Last but not least, tip number eight, you're going to want to aim for steady rates. So this is especially important to do in your high profit locations. Paying commission could cause you to lose a lot more money than if you were to pay a steady rate. And that's my list of pro tips about how to start and maximize your sales in the vending machine business. I hope you found everything you needed. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Please like and subscribe. Until next time.